Collins decided recently that he didn't like his old trench coat anymore, that he needed a new one. But the thought of just throwing away the coat bothered him. After all, it's more than a trench coat. It's a reporter's best friend. You must remember this. The trench coat. In the 30s and 40s, Bogey loved them. Today, they're one of the most popular items of outerwear in any men's store. Our sales show that basically, and that's the industry norm for that matter, is that we sell about two to one of the trench coat uh, double-breasted style as opposed to the single-breasted uh, winter coat. For those of us in news, the coat is much more than just a necessity. It's a uniform. It has literally replaced the hat with a press card in it as a symbol of the craft. It's come a long way from its inception in World War I, designed by a company called Burberry for British officers to wear in the trenches. And my coat has come a long way, too, since I first bought it back in 1979. Oh, sure, some of the buttons are gone, but the, the journalistic memories live on. Like the time Frank Sinatra didn't give me an interview, or the day the newsroom hinted that maybe I needed a new one. Oh, I know what they were thinking when they sent me down that ski slope. Maybe he'll tear it. And see this spot here? It takes me back to a special day last September. I was here in the dugout with Pete as he was about to step up to bat and make the greatest hit of all time. Sweat was pouring down his face. He reached for a towel, none was around. I said, here, Pete, take my coat. And the rest is history. So now it's over. And where do old trench coats go? Why, to here, the Trench Coat Hall of Fame. Names like Murrow, Cronkite, Peter Grant, and others, and, and mine's over here. And as you can see, some coats are placed in more prominent positions than others. As time goes by. Michael Collins, News 5 tonight. It's <laughs> remarkable. Uh, do you believe it? Yeah. Yeah. It's just... Yeah. It's breaking it's, me it's up. It's sad. A trench coat will be the perfect weekend weather.